we started the discussion with one word and that is pure and we said pure hair does not mean unadulterated then what is pure we know one thing that mixture is not pure then what is pure mixture is made of pure substances what are those pure substances those pure substances are elements an element is pure because it is made of same type of atoms and from wherever you may take that element it will have same properties for example whether oxygen is in air or in soil it has the same property it helps in burning it is a supporter of combustion but this is not all there is another form of pure substance and that is a compound the compound is also made up of same type of molecules for example water water is made up of oxygen and hydrogen and they are combined together in the ratio of 1 is to 8 one part of hydrogen and eight parts of oxygen so from wherever you may take water it will have same composition same oxygen and hydrogen in same ratio i know you are not going to agree with me you are going to say sea water is so different in taste from tap water but whether it is sea water or it is tap water they are not the purest form of water they are mixtures because many different type of salts are dissolved in them the pure form of water like the one we get after distillation has only oxygen and hydrogen there are many such compounds like for to understand it a little better what you can do is you can take some iron filings and sulfur powder mix it how well you may mix you will be able to see yellow color somewhere gray color of iron somewhere then in another one you heat it and it will become a black mass and that will be iron sulfide now this is made up of two elements iron and sulfur which have combined in a fixed ratio as in the case of water hydrogen and oxygen always in the fixed ratio here iron and sulfur in fixed ratio and what they form is compound in a mixture like i gave you the example of india two people are together they retain their original or individual culture in a mixture also same thing happens the components retain their individual properties but not so in the case of a compound if you have taken this mixture and then you take a magnet near it what will happen the iron filings will be attracted towards magnet and when we clean it in another container we can collect the iron filings so the magnetic property of iron has been retained and by this method we can also separate the two because sulfur is non magnetic so by using magnet we can separate the two but here if we take magnet near the iron sulfide nothing is attracted towards magnet because now it has undergone a complete change a new substance has been formed the color is also uniform it is neither gray nor yellow it is black which means physical properties have changed even the chemical properties have changed now it is not a magnetic property is not there iron cannot be separated so in a compound what we find is that the individual properties are lost not that in the case of a mixture